If you guys like it back to back, let me know that down in the comments. It will keep doing it like this. Back to back, we're on Wednesday, season one, episode six. No recap because we're being consistent. The dad went to prison. He out of prison and literally, well, jail. County jail. For one day, he was in there one night. I would say maybe two nights. So they could solve the case. Um, it was it was more deep. Now we're questioning the, um, the principal, the professor of the whole school. So, yeah, let's get to the bottom of all of their secrets. Another a killer of creatures out there. Eugene, hold on tight, baby. We got you. We a detective. We will figure it out. Oh gosh. Okay, we might fast forward this part, y'all. We're not about to do this. In case you're wondering, I don't hold seances very often. Ma'am, hurry up, because you're about to get fast forward. Sorry, sorry, sorry. We don't do that. Sorry. I didn't mean to interrupt your... You have a relative named Goody? She was one of the original outcasts. You thought about using one of my scented candles? I doubt she communicates in magazine cutouts. <laughs> exactly. If you won't answer, meet me inside. Oh. I was fine on my own. Damn. Okay. She's such a savage. Ew. It's dank. What died? <laughs> it smells like childhood. Come on. Never be by yourself. Whoever you are, show yourself. I think it's what's his name. Try anything and you'll lose limbs. Is it exactly? Surprise! This was thoughtful. Happy birthday <laughs> to you. The pink balloon was my little touch. Why don't you make a wish? <laughs> That's what they said. The first part of that phrase was burned on an Evermore song. Yep. It can't be a coincidence. Wednesday. To stop Crackstone, these ways we must seek. You always speak in riddles, only seeing the darkness within them. They look just alike. Is that supposed to scare me? You should. Careful. That's my cold shoulder. The subterfuge was impressive. May your 16th be as sour and misery filled as your desire, your ever doting mother and father. Oh, she was 15. Now they she's 16. They to hide it before they left on parents' weekend. Uh, so just dissect them like what we doing? Wow, well, we're still accepting presents. That's not a good present. Just weird. <laughs> what is it exactly? It's a snood, silly. I made it in your signature colors. And you want to know what the best part is? We can wear them together to class. Oh, a scarf? Oh. Like a funeral. Hopefully nobody dying. Yes, well, I'm in your debt, Larissa. Yeah. I don't need your gratitude. Just find the delinquents responsible. Careful, noble. <laughs> My charity has its limits. I don't know if it's one of the students or teachers. They all iffy. I didn't realize we were back on speaking terms. <laughs> I showed up to your surprise party. I figured that would have been a hint. Yeah, well, when you change your mind and you want my help, you know where to find me. Yeah, I don't think it's him anymore. Honestly, I did at first. <laughs> Where'd you get that? The bracelet. Where'd you get it? Lucas, usually I'd call BS on something like that. What woman? For some reason. You believed her. <laughs> yeah. You believe. And she turned out to be right. Do yourself a favor. Delete that app. Mm. The more you listen to them, the more they sink their claws into you. To not get sucked into morning song. Because you're just the type they're looking for. Hey. I'll be at the weather vane later if you want to stop by. Maybe we can exchange notes on self-improvement. Besides, my parents always made sure my birthdays were memorable. I bet. Let's see what you did. Not bad. How you get all them friends there? <laughs> yeah, they didn't know about the spiders, huh? Mm-mm. Because -mm, I wouldn't have came. No, that'd be cool if they really found a kid to put real spiders on. <laughs> I was like, nah, wicked. But now, parties but interesting. and presents and games that... <laughs> I haven't seen you since our session with your family, which was certainly one I won't forget. How are things going with them? My mother and I spent some quality time together. I'm working with them. 
Trauma like this leaves emotional scars on the whole family. They had to head home for a few days, so I promised I'd check in on him. She's a very distant cousin. Very distant. Sounds like she doesn't see you for who you really are. She sees more than you know. Consider it my birthday gift. Yeah, that's what sucks about it. She knows how to read people. <laughs> that's what sucks about the therapist. Oh shoot, death certificate. Oh, is, uh, is that Enid's gift? <laughs> it's perfect if you're fleeing a war-torn country on foot. So if I asked you out to a non-birthday song-free dinner, that'd be something you're interested in? I have a tight deadline. Emphasis on dead. Where is it? What's that supposed to be? A gate to a house. Never mind. To a big house. I feel like ever since the raven, you've kind of been ghosting me. Am I wrong? I just feel like he's so pushy. Tall black, two sugars to go? An APB and a dead cobra. I figured since you no longer have an old vendetta to obsess over, you're free to solve some real crime. I don't bury hatchets. I sharpen them. <laughs> Ma'am. When did you draw this? A couple days ago. Wow. I started having those dreams again. Like before. So you have dreams, she has visions. Do you know where this is? And see old Gates Mansion. I pass it when I go running. Nah, that's good. Whoever really drew that in real life is amazing. Not to forget about you, but I couldn't. We know it wasn't him. So I started painting, and that's what came out. All right. I feel like it's the only time I get to see the real you. It's her happy place. Uh, could you do me a favor? Wednesday forgot this. Could you give it back to her? Birthday gift from Enid. Sure. No problem. I was just leaving anyway. Take your advice. Good. Wanted someone to talk to. Mm. I feel like we're in the same boat. No matter how hard I try, there will always be people who look down on me. I think a lot of the kids can't relate. I think I'll never amount to anything. Guess I was angry that my dad was humiliated on outreach day. And I paid back. I realized I needed to wipe the board, you know, start over. This is where Garrett Gates lived. The boy my father was accused of murdering. Goody showed me this house for a reason. I need to unlock its secrets or die trying. So yeah, I don't think we should have went alone. Somebody got right there. Oh my gosh, who is it? The sheriff. He's been looking in on the case though, so. And he is a mayor, not a detective. So, I need a distraction. Get this. And ride with them? I don't think we should. Oh, come on, hurry up. <laughs> Not somebody hitting the mayor. And somebody seen. They in a blue Cadillac. Hurry up. Hurry up, Sheriff. Oh my gosh. Nah, he was, he was digging. That's why they killed him. Feels so bad. I already gave it to your deputy. Blue Cadillac with no license plates. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know. Blue Cadillac. House hunting. I overheard the voicemail he left you. I was intrigued. In that booth, most of the time, they went nowhere. Call me old fashioned, but when someone is run over on the way to give the police key information. Somebody's still alive, they have to no, be. They're all dead every last one. Nah, somebody alive. <laughs> Unless ghosts can come alive in here, which won't be surprising. I think should the school should have been on lockdown after Eugene almost died. Mm, mm, mm. Wednesday. I just heard what happened only looking out for your best interests. You could have been seriously hurt or worse. Intriguing. I saw this on my bookshelf and thought of you. Mary Shelley wrote it on a dare when she was only 19. Being whatever real ones might be out there to the authorities. Nah. No man chooses evil because it is evil. He only mistakes it for happiness. No. But she will expel you if you continue to defy her. Hmm. So you're only looking out for my best interest? Y'all yeah, kind of are. I don't need your help. She used to be you, ma'am. I already have a mother and a therapist. <laughs> she used That's to be you. That's torture, even for me. I've reconsidered your offer. My offer? The non-birthday dinner. Really? That's great. Um, 
tight. What did I tell you? Come on, bud. Steer clear of Wednesday, Adam. She's leave me another type. What? Yeah, was... yeah, his mama. I can't deal with this right now. You never can. I gotta get to the hospital. I gotta check. You out. never can, Dad. Before curfew. Then love y'all, son. Go to therapy with them. Talk it out. Just two best friends. <gasps> I thought you was going with. the school is on lockdown. Do you look at that full moon? How about I say I'm about to wolf out and get a pass to the looping cages and say so you volunteered to lock me in? Oh, we should wear our snoods. Like a monkey's paw. Uh, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> <laughs> She's sneaking up on us. Look, it's not a date. <laughs> this is so wrong. Wait. He's our Uber driver? Uber? Don't ask. Twinsies. Just drive. <laughs> Why do we let her do this to us, y'all? Why do we let her treat us like this? Nah, Wednesday, that's wrong. You cannot just keep using people. But she gonna keep doing it as long as y'all let her. Yikes. I just wanna talk You're to you You're 10 for minutes too late. Mm -hmm. this place we know he gonna tell. He loves snitching. <laughs> Okay, this isn't what I signed on for. You didn't have to yeah, that's wrong. If you want to go, you can. I'm gonna go. She check needed out the to get out, and she needed a ride. Yeah, he's stronger. I'm guessing. <laughs> yeah. <Where was> <laughs> the? <laughs> Cause the what? killer's car. So he can take me back to Neverwar and get me expelled. No. Okay. It's not gonna happen. Just don't split apart. Just stay together. <laughs> There's Garrett. His outcast hating father, Ansel. And you must be Laurel. The daughter, the, the sister. You're trying to find a hidden door. That's in the Adams Family movie too. Seen enough? But it was their house. Maybe it's the dad. The dad ain't dead. Blood will rain when I rise. <gasps> oh no. They just left. Run for him. So you check the rest of the it's more for. scary. Well, hold up. Tyler don't want to be alone. Like, just because he a man don't mean he want to be alone. <laughs> because why is Wednesday calling the shots? Uh-uh. You wanted to have fun with your friend? I know what my mom would say. Mean it. You're a doormat. A doormat? We don't always want to be Wednesday? tough. Wednesday, you need to see this. So it is her. Somebody moved back into their old room. It's not possible. She died 25 years ago, drowned overseas. <laughs> what the? Look at the ugly thing. Not your kid. Going to mess it up. Yeah, we getting in no matter what. Dang. It's the killer. Yeah, well, you kind of in her house. Girl, come on, Wednesday. These are the body parts missing from the monster's victim. Take a picture. Okay. Since when do you care? They should have tried to come out the window though. That would have been more realistic. Can you walk? Oh! Where'd you come from? This is bad timing. <laughs> Not to make this about me, but I am having a full blown panic mm -hmm. attack right now. We need to get back before Reems realizes we've been gone. <laughs> you see something? I mean, yeah, we can take him back to the house. Let's see. There's no way. We cleared this place out after we left. Wow. Listen, yesterday I told you all signs pointed to this house, and I was right. You are forbidden from seeing Tyler, and you are forbidden from pursuing anything to do with this case. Understood? Which is grounds for expulsion, I know. You out of here. And you have every right to exercise that option. I do believe it would be a grave error on your part. <laughs> she really is trying to <laughs> just solve the case, get back to, you know, reality. Somebody done hurt Eugene, a whole kid. Wasn't the first kid because she almost died too, you know? 
like at the beginning of the first episode so i mean she did break the rules and we do have rules here but she is trying to do a good thing but she is putting herself in danger that's the big thing that gets me like she wants the danger she wants to keep going towards the danger is this why he tried to kill you his mother drew it before she died said i was destined to destroy the school hmm but i think i'm meant to say that please <laughs> Be glad you gotta please. Be glad. One more step out of line and you will be expelled. No ifs, no buts. Enid and Xavier are spared as well. No more negotiation. Thornhill said I could crash there for a few nights. Oh, she leaving. There's no the need. Room. I spoke with Wayne. You and Xavier won't be punished. Couldn't even be bothered to cut. You will use anyone to get what you want, even if it means putting them in danger. Always put myself out there. Thought of your feelings. She people, did. I know she gives off serial killer vibes, but she's really just shy. And the fact that you don't know that says everything. No, I stick beside her when she say that because it's the realness for me. It's the realness for me. She is not wrong. She said everything perfect. You want to be alone one day? Be alone. She has to take responsibility, accountability. That's not what friends do. Of course. Of course. <gasps> She's been watching you from the from a tree, from a sky. Ooh, that was high up. That house. That family. Yeah, that family. <laughs> Crackstone. Who is when it? Mayor Walker got too close to the truth. He had to die. Silenced. Come on. Now the hospital has to have cameras. I will find you. I will find you. <laughs> Nah, cause she really is. She, she, she putting everybody in jeopardy to find you. So what's going to happen? All of this is not for nothing. But again, I'm with a friend because how dare you? How you gonna use me? How you gonna do this to me? Like she said, she put herself out there literally every episode, every day. And she, Wednesday is never pleased. She's not. I mean, when she really want friends, she don't know how to treat friends, you know? When she really want to care for somebody, she don't know how to care for somebody. And that goes back to, I understand because I don't know how to be excited for some things, you know? It's just like, I don't know how to be excited. Although I want to be deep down inside and it hurts my heart that I don't know how to be excited. But, I don't know. So I get where she's Wednesday's coming from, but then again, I don't. Because that is wrong. Because I know I know what a real friend is. You know, I know how to be a real friend. And like her friends say, you, sh you don't have to tell me. I have your back even when you're not in the room. I have your back even when you're not in the room. You don't have to worry about that. You don't have to tell me twice. You don't have to tell me once. I have you. I got you. And she was a real friend. I feel like we can agree on that. She was a real friend. Put your pins down below. How do you feel about episode? How do you feel about episode six? We got two more episodes. Let's get straight into it. Let's go.